Hey guys, what's up? It's Alex. It's Wednesday, so a new Photoshop tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add effects to your text because I see a lot of people trying to make a stroke like taking the brush and, and go around the letters, adding shadow just by taking a brush tool or whatever. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to add proper outlines, uh, strokes, how you want to call it, um, outer glow, gradients. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. Okay, so as you can see, I have this random stock footage from Windows, this picture loaded into Photoshop. And let's say we want to have a word like right here. So basically, we want to go to little T from text, click right here. I'm going to write test. Put it right there. Press the little check mark. And then what we're going to do is we're going to right click on our text layer, blending options, and then you get this dialog. This is your panel to add all the effects. So basically, we're going to go from the top to the bottom. So right now, this is nothing special about it. But uh, if you want to have like an outline, you're going to press on stroke. And as you can see, there's a stroke around the word test. So if you want to have a bigger stroke, you can mess around with the size. As you can see, it's getting really thick or, or maybe like really thin like that. You can change the color. You can do it whatever color you want. You can make it red. You can make it purple and make it blue. You can make it green. You can make it yellow and all kind of stuff. So and you also can change the opacity like you just change the opacity of the outline. Lines. As you can see, I can just put it right there and, you know, I can add it opacity and you know, all that kind of stuff. So if you want to have like a certain effect, you can use that. So um, yeah, let's take stroke, take a four. That's good enough. And then if you want to have like a gradient, like yellow at the top on your, of your text and blue on the bottom, we're going to click on gradient overlay and then we're going to click on gradient and then you can make your own colors right here. So let's say we want to go from white skin color and we press yellow. Go right there, maybe like this. Press OK, and then right here, this is the bottom. Click on it, click on this little color bar. I'm gonna put this to blue, right there. Press OK, and as you can see, the text is yellow at the top and blue at the bottom. And you have all like these presets, like three colors and stuff, or just blue from transparent, or you can blue to yellow, you can have like all those multiple colors like that. You can pick a lot of colors, you can just make like stripes. You can do everything with it, so you can like play around with it and um, see what you trying to find. It's really awesome, it's a really awesome tool. So uh, let's say we're gonna just make it a bit yellow at the top, bluish on the bottom. So we're gonna press OK. And the next thing we're gonna do is we wanna have an outer glow. We want to have our text a little bit glowing. So as you can see, there's nothing too much. You can't see anything yet. And even though it's it's checkmarked, put the blend mode to normal. And then you wanna just opacity, you wanna have a max. And then you wanna just choose your glow color. Let's say we're gonna pick red so you can see it. Press OK, but you can't see anything yet. So basically we need to mess around with the size bar. As you can see right there, the glow is appearing. It's really awesome. It's not a shadow. It's just a glow from the text. It looks like a shadow, but it's actually just a glow. As you can see, really thin. You can mess around with it. You can change it to even, you know, like purple, pinkish. Press OK and you know, that kind of stuff. It's, it's, it's really awesome tools. Let's say we wanna have a black glow. So basically we're gonna drag it a little bit to the left. That's a little bit too much. And the last thing you wanna add shadow to your text. This is going to make your text is kind of loose from the background. So we're going to go to the bottom right here and check mark drop shadow. And you also want to put the blending modes to normal. And then you can just mess around with the size. And then you want to put the opacity to 100% and you can mess around with the size. And this is the shadow. This is not a glow. So you can put it maybe like red or something. As you can see, there is just, that's just the shadow of the text. That's how simple it is, guys. You can mess with this um, layer style dialogue to like whatever you want with your text. If you're happy with it, you can just press OK right here. And there, and that's it. You can move your text around if you want to. If you like this video, feel free to subscribe down below for more videos. It's always appreciated. If you find this video helpful, feel free to leave a thumbs up down below. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.